rig exploded. Local and national agencies have been doing everything they can to try and contain the oil and stop it from coming ashore. Fox News reporter Derricka Williams tells us the Coast Guard's been trying to block the slick, but the agency is now tweaking its approach. Since the Deepwater Horizon blast, oil has been spewing into the Gulf of Mexico. Now it rates approximately 5,000 barrels a day. Agencies from Louisiana to Florida are working hard trying to contain the leak and guard the coastline. The U.S. Coast Guard is using boom as a barrier. Boom is essentially a, uh, a fence or a gate in the water that, that keeps the floating oil from going any further. Um, if you see it it, it, it floats on top of the water, but then there's anywhere from 18 to 40, 48 inches hanging beneath it that you can't see that guard against the oil passing by. Yeah. Lieutenant James McKnight says boom works great in calm water, but some of their recent efforts have been washed away by stormy weather. The rough waters have caused oily water to lap over the boom, ripping it apart. Our, our estimation is we put out approximately 19,000 feet of boom yesterday. Our goal today is to put out 50% more. But one of the big goals for today was to uh, better tend the boom, um, figure out new ways of keeping it anchored and in place, and keeping track of it better. Part of what we're doing is employing local vessels to help us with this. One of, the, one of the anticipations is possibly using local vessels just to keep an eye on the boom and where it is. The yellow and orange boom are just one of the ways the Coast Guard is protecting our shoreline. There's another safeguard for when the oil finally makes landfall. The absorbent boom, um, it, it kind of looks like links of sausage and it's, it's white and it's a, and it's a, a oil absorbent material and it actually attracts oil and 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 soaks up the oil like a sponge um oil is coming it is going to get there but we do want to get make sure that we guard every chance everything that we can do to guard against that reporting from mobile derricka williams fox 10 news and the coast guard says it may use barriers to help ward off the oil the National Guard builds barriers that are made of a wire mesh with a membrane inside. They can fill it with rocks, with sand or seashells, just to keep it in place.